Hey guys, just wanted to do a relatively quick tool video. Um, this thing is pretty sweet for anybody into RC. It's a power screwdriver. And this is a skill. You can get it off Amazon. I think I paid like 35 bucks for it. But it comes with just a ton of bits. All in this magnetic holder, which is kind of cool. I mean, you got security bits, security Torx bits, any bit you'll ever need. All the kinds of, uh, you know, different sizes of Phillips. And then this extension. And the USB, micro USB charger. And then this is the screwdriver itself. And you have directional with that. So forward, reverse, easily with your thumb. It's got lights on it. And I'm just going to do a quick demo of this. Um, I don't think it has a part number on the box. It's just that. It just says skill. But anyway, going to do a quick demo. Going to put another motor in the Red Cat Volcano. Um, yet again, so 30 second time is the charm. So let's get to it. Alright guys, so you can see this thing works pretty good. If you're doing something with really high torque, it's probably not going to be for you like a sheetrock screw or something weird like that. But for hobby stuff, this thing's awesome. It's got plenty of torque. So I got the new motor in the Red Cat Volcano for my son. And this is the stock motor that it came with. The 16 turn, just Red Cat Racing silver cam motor. And as you can see, I've used sheetrock tape and put around the outside. Because the first motor that was in here, which was this one, was really good. It lasted a long time. But the thing that killed it is little rocks got in the fan, um, the ducts right there. You know how 550 motors have the openings. So I put this over it, um, not underneath the heat sink because that would affect the cooling. But I put these over all the, the little ducts in the side of the motor there to try to keep rocks from getting in the motor. Because that's what killed the other one. I also did the end bell on the vents there. So air will be able to flow through there with the fan, but hopefully it'll keep out some rocks and keep this thing alive for a while. So thanks for watching, guys. I think the Skill Screwdriver off Amazon is a great tool. It's, uh, you know, it kind of gives my wrists a break because I use my hands a lot all day. So it's nice to just be able to push a button one direction or the other. You have a work light. Just a cool tool. Thanks for watching, guys.